<laughs> well, it's hard to believe that uh, we're celebrating 10 years. This is the 10th anniversary of the Ford Ironman Panama City Beach here in Florida. And what a great race this is. And uh, oh, did I mention that it's Halloween, everyone? Happy Halloween. Tonight, the kids will be out trick or treating. Tomorrow night, a big old Halloween party. And uh, as we see the Grim Reaper there come up and. Uh, Geez, I'm glad he left my head on. Okay, the course, same as usual, a two-lap swim course, 2.4 miles. It is 1.2 miles around the loop. And then you get out of the water, come around the barriers and head back in. A great swim course, very, very easy to navigate. The bike course, however, the hardest part about it is a hill, around about 8 to 10 miles into it. That's the hardest part. There's just a lot of turns and it's a lot of flat. So no freewheeling whatsoever and no let up for those legs on the bike. 112 miles is the distance. Now on the run course, it is two loops. So you go out 13.1 miles and you turn around right out the front of the uh, finish area. Now the turnaround at the far end of the course is at St. Andrews State Park. It's very, very nice out there. Nice views of the water coming in to the lakes there. Okay, and then all the way back to the finish line, this is going to be an early finish, well, an early uh, a sunset. It's going to be about 5.30 in the afternoon. So this is the race where I believe most of the finishers finish in the dark. Okay, that is my view from the edge. I am Greg Welch for Ironman.com.